all right guys um you're welcome back to across nigeria so uh imo state government have released a distasteful photos of deputy governor's lodge so uh, the deputy governor of imo state um, gerald irona led a team of government officials um, on friday that is the 7th of june to inspect deputy governor's lodge at commissioner's quarters in Oweri. All right, so um, today is Sunday, the 9th of June, 2019. Okay, so the time I'm bringing you this report is about 1.05 p.m. on Sunday. So um, um, the, the, the photos you are seeing on the screen right now, okay, you are seeing them um, one after the other. Um, is the interior and exterior section of the lodge released by the Imo State media team after the facility tour. So recall that um, there was um, a photo, embarrassing photos, that were released after Governor Ihedio had inspected the Imo government house. Okay, his um, predecessor, Richard Okorocha, left behind. So rumors um, was that, uh, rumor that was going around since then was that um, he had you actually planned um, by the government or uh, by the governor to set aside uh, five billion naira to renovate the governor's lodge okay so that was the accusation that um, is actually the reason why he was sharing those um, photos about um, the inspection of the government house um, that he was planning to set aside five billion naira that is to squander five billion naira in renovation of the government house so um, regarding the deputy governor's lodge uh, you have to recall that the former deputy governor okay so you are seeing uh, the slide of those images there okay so record that this former governor of uh, deputy governor is a madu mere okay has been on um, a larger head with former governor richard sokorocha shortly uh, before the apc primary Okay, which held in October 2018, okay, due to Okorocha's preferred choice of successor. So, um, what you of the note is that former Deputy Governor Madhu Meres stopped living at the official lodge since the conflict with his former boss. Okay, so um, since last year actually, and the lodge had been unoccupied ever since then. All right, so you are seeing the images so far. This is so disgusting, okay? To be frank, I really don't know what is going on with these guys, all right? So um, the people of Oweri, let us just pray. I'm not from Oweri, but um, I, I really, I, I really want to pray with you guys um, that I believe, let us just hope. I'm not affiliated to any political party, but um, as a Nigerian, as a one Nigerian, I really think we don't have any other choice. We don't have anything else to do than to keep praying for our own leaders, for God to touch their hearts. Believe me, we are uh, we can't do anything. Okay, so the only thing we should be praying for is um, God should actually touch their heart. You know, this is how God would touch somebody's heart, and the person would just maybe God will even use the person without his own knowledge. So that is the only thing everybody should be praying all right so god should touch their heart it's not going to be by our own will because no matter what we do those guys they have um, the power to do whatever they have to do so um, it's just for us to pray god uh, should touch their heart for them to do the needful all right so looking at all these photos it's so so disgusting that this is the deputy governor's lodge in Imo state all right guys so you've seen it all i don't have any other thing to show you than to show you these photos you have seen everything all right so um if you have anything to contribute okay you can put it down in the comment section below i really don't want to talk about my own personal opinion before you guys start attacking me that i am being biased okay i'm supporting a particular political party which i am not all right, so that's the photos. I just um, wanted to bring you this report for you guys to see what is going on in the deputy governor's lodge in Imo State. All right, if this is your first time on my channel, don't forget 
to hit that red subscribe button just support the ministry by clicking on that red subscribe button down the video below all right um so you get notified whenever i bring you stories and what is going on across nigeria and if you need um, a youtube channel i am currently organizing a youtube training it's an online training for any person anybody that wants to start a youtube channel and make a passive income posting videos on youtube just like my channel here so the training will cover us how to create those videos these videos i'm creating i'm actually using my android phone how to create videos how to post videos how to make your video goes viral it's not about posting video there are tips and tricks and secrets which i want to show you guys on how to make your video goes viral whenever you post your video okay and how to make money posting videos on youtube just like the way i am doing we also design a world class website if you need a website for your business for your organization you can also contact us we design your website for you all right guys so that's the story i will see you guys if you have anything to contribute you can put it down in the comment section below i will see you guys in the next video this is across nigeria